Hello everyone and welcome again here on my channel Cheerful Dev. I hope you are doing good, I hope you are doing well and I hope you are having a beautiful week. If not, remember guys, it will always get better. Just never give up, never give up guys. So uh, let's get started with this video, right? Uh, Unity just released a new package and it is something new and really really amazing and it will help developers around the world to uh, make their work faster if they don't have like uh, a phone available to test their game so now you can test your game directly inside unity without needing uh, a, an external uh, simulator or to use your phone with a cable into install the unity remote and stuff like this they just decided to make a package and they give it the name device simulator now with this version the device simulator is an alternative to the traditional unity editor game window by simulating screen and system info class behaviors so the device simulator aims to give an accurate pictures of how an app will look on a device basically what does it mean you can now test your game and see how it will look in an iphone or on a samsung or an uh, any device and you can see the boundary for your uh, UI and for your characters and how high he can jump like he can get off the screen and everything so to get this package guys it's really easy let's get started uh, we, I, <laughs> I talk a lot guys I know uh, just just deal with this guys for now <laughs> and I'm so sorry so uh, when you open unity you open any project just an empty scene it's okay you go to window here and you go to the package manager you find this package manager here you click it and it will show you this uh, package manager here you go and click this all package here and check this all package you click this one here and it will show you all the previews and all the packages that exist inside unity and you will scroll to find the device simulator here you click it and you click install I did already install it here on my uh, unity here on this project and if there is an update click this update and if there is none it will uh, be disabled like this so uh, just install it and wait for the installation to uh, finish it and when you have unity uh, installed the simulator device correctly you go here to this scene as you see we have here uh, this is our scene you go to the game tab this one here and you click on this game you will notice that now you have uh, a second choice which is simulator so when we click this simulator here it will switch our view scene into something like this now we have a simulator here and I can rotate this one however I want so um, I think we need to rotate this one something around here uh, can I get this one right? <laughs> That's not how it should look guys. <laughs> the rotation is really 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 bad. Uh, I think there is a problem with my rotation here. It's okay. It is okay guys. Uh, and of course you can scale this however you want. So you can zoom in and zoom out. But there is something with the rotation is wrong <laughs> guys. <laughs> we need to fix the rotation. But... Uh, <laughs> it's really uh, really cool <laughs> so let's let's work with this one uh, as it's right now uh, I think I can switch back to the game menu here and go back to the simulator I think it will try to fix it and no we still have this uh, <laughs> this scene here it's okay guys uh, let's switch this from an iPad and as you can see here we have guys a lot a lot of amazing uh, device all the devices that exist I think in the world <laughs> Unity always is a hit guys of everyone so they have already here uh, everything that you may need and let's pick something cool here like let's let's, let's say an, an iPhone X Max like something like this <laughs> and we still have the rotation problem but that is okay let me just scale this one a little bit so we can see the whole uh, iPhone here and as you can see uh, here we have uh, a simulator for our game here inside this game and you can see directly here how your game will look inside this uh, device now there is uh, some problem <laughs> there is a problem <laughs> I'm so sorry guys 
Now there is a problem with the rotation, I don't know why there is this one so I will uncheck this uh, auto select here and I will make this into a, a portrait like this. Let's see, now we have this way uh, and I will make this into a landscape right. Let's see if we can, yes we did this guys, we have this uh, device as we want it but it's from, <laughs> from left to the right. It is totally okay guys and we, I think we can play with this. Uh, anyway we can play with those uh, screen settings here as you can see here. We can play with them and make any size that you want for our screen. We can change this to like from left to the right uh, I think. This may fix it, it may not, I don't care. For now, all that matters to me is, is that we have a working uh, preview right now. So it looks really cool and here we have uh, and here we have all this cool stuff. Here you can see this device specification, the type of the iOS, the CPU, the GPU, the resolution. You can see the screen settings as I said before here. We can play with the application settings so we can make it into an English device or whatever that you want. And here you can see you can switch between the simulator and the game however you want. You can even reload the scene into a new one. You can show the safe area for your UI when you create a game you want to see where your UI will look like right the buttons and stuff like this this marks the safe area where you can do this you can uh, fit the screen so it will fit the size of the screen we have here uh, we can take this out we can scale it however we want this is really really amazing guys and this is a cool device now you will not be obliged to install Unity Remote on your phone or to use an, uh, an external uh, simulator or to keep always your phone close to you to test your game and stuff like this you can just go ahead do it inside Unity directly and you will have your design and everything tested inside Unity without using any like outside uh, processor or any of this stuff that is really cool, I will keep uh, a link in the description if you want to go and read about this in the Unity website or you can just follow this video, install this and use it in your uh, projects. I hope you will find this video useful guys, if you are new to this channel, hit the subscribe button guys. <laughs> we are close to 1000 subscribers, I'm really really happy uh, to see you guys supporting this channel. Thank you so much and like if you don't like this video and hopefully I will see you guys in the next video. See you soon.